y'all so i have something that i want to share that has been pressing on my heart and i hate to be like redundant and i hate to like repeat myself all the time but this is just something i just feel like i want to talk about and say really quick y'all know that my channel is called wife stuff and i really really love the name of my channel i'm not changing the name of my channel by the way but i just feel like lately i said it in a previous vlog i just don't feel like i'm sharing as much wife wifely duties and wifely things as i should and something that's just been pressing on my heart and kind of like the scripture that i want to be the anchor for this channel is titus 2. i just feel like that just speaks volumes to me that is something that i really am holding close to my heart and the times and the days that we're living in i truly believe that jesus is coming back soon and i just think it's so important that older women and i'm not talking about old women i'm not talking about like that i'm talking about wisdom people with wisdom people with talents people with gifts um being a homemaker is a very high calling and i truly believe that god gifted me and allowed me to be a homemaker i truly think that i was born to be a homemaker i enjoy it i love cooking i love cleaning i love just decorating my home i love all of it now i'm not going to sit here and pretend that i love it all the time but of course there are mundane days and all of that but you know for the most part like as an overall in general when i sit back and i look at my family and i look at like me cooking or cleaning or whatever i do take joy in that and i do take pride in that because i know that that was you know gifted to me by the lord and so i just want to share more of that here on my channel and i just feel that it's just important that I share these things. I think that, like I said, in this time and this generation that we're living in, we need to be prepared. We need to be ready with skills and things that we can provide our family because I just think that not knowing or not being able to provide for your family is not a good thing. I think that God gifted us for a reason and I just feel like if we can do something if we can show or gift somebody else something then we should and that is what titus 2 is for me i believe that we are called to teach and we are called to do you know pass down you know from generation to generation the knowledge and the wisdom that we have gained and so i want to do that through cooking and cleaning and all of those things so you're going to see more of that type of content here on my channel um i you know i set out to do that in the beginning i really did but you know along the way i've just gotten lost and i i keep like getting distracted and i keep getting involved in other things and honestly um doing the makeovers and stuff really set into perspective you know where my heart is and what um what is important to me in all of that in that process god was really just speaking to me and telling me like you know your priorities aren't in order you need to get your home in order you need to get your relationship with me in order again and i you know I've just been so distracted and so like neglectful of the things that matter and God just showed me that I can't multitask in that way. That is a struggle. Multitasking, being able to be present in the time and you know being with my family, being present in the activity that I'm doing, not thinking about all the other 50 million things that I have to do. And I know that being a mom and a wife there, you are going to have to, you know, multitask in some type of way. But I was just diving so deep into all these projects and not carrying out my relationship with Christ and not carrying out my relationships with others just in general. Not, you know, I was always neglecting one thing or the other. So I really hope that y'all will just join me and be patient with me and know that I love y'all and I want to share you know the things that god has gifted me with and the things that i'm going to you know again be walking through the lord is working right now and he is calling so many people for the harvest and i i'm just 
I'm just here for it, honestly. I am just here for it. We have a busy day today. By we, I mean Enoch and I. We are about to go to a friend's house for a Bible study, and then I am not sure what all else, but for now, that is what I'm getting ready to go do. Uh, but I have like a whole laundry list of things that I need to get done. So. Oh my goodness, we just walked in the door. I am super tired, but there's like still so much. I'm actually not all that tired. I feel like I've been moving all day, so I actually feel like I have a little bit more energy to give. I feel like if I sit down, then I really will be done for the day. I'm gonna tackle a few dishes, get some laundry put up. I have like a whole basket full of laundry that needs to be put away. Um, I threw a pizza just now in the oven for Enoch because he's starving not really it's just that um when he's tired he didn't take a nap today so when he's tired like this he will like try to eat and just like keep his mind stimulated and stuff so that he can stay awake so it'll probably be an early bedtime tonight uh but anyways i want to get all that stuff tackled tonight the best i can so that way I can uh, get him in bed. I can feel like I did something around here and accomplished something. Um, exhausted I feel like this has just been the longest day ever but in a good way like it had I had a really great day I got a lot done I didn't get to everything that I said I was gonna get to but that's all right hopefully I'll get to it tomorrow but yeah I am wore out last night I went to bed at like 11 15 which is late for me honestly usually I get in bed about nine something and then I'm asleep by 10 and I've been waking up early I've been waking up at least by six so yeah mama is tired today but I do need to get Enoch in the bed and I need a shower and all of that still because I feel kind of gross but yeah I feel like today was a successful day I got a lot accomplished um I'm excited about it got the kitchen cleaned up and got my coffee pot set to go off in the morning so I am I mean that's all I gotta say is that was a good day got a bible study in like it's it's a it's a it's a wrap for today but yeah um, I had a really, really great day. So I'm going to close us out here and I will see y'all in the next one. God bless y'all and go and be a light out there. Hey y'all, if you enjoyed today's video and don't want to miss out on content like this, then please click over here to subscribe to my channel. Or if you want to watch more videos like this, then you can click right here.